We're talking food. We're talking a new season of Texans Eat. It kicks off tomorrow morning on GMSA or right after GMSA. And this season, David Elder has more tasty food for us to enjoy. That's right. And guess what? David Elder is actually here Woo. right now. Look at that. Thank I'm you for excited, being here. y'all. Yeah, are you excited? We, are too. we got a whole new season of Texas Eats coming. So, what do you got? So, I mean, we're going to start off the whole new season right here with beignets. And that's what we got here on the show for you okay. guys. Mike, Stephanie, David, I know you guys are hungry. They got you over here working a lot of hours. You guys have been here all Thanks. morning. <laughs> Wow. Yo, you took a whole dozen there, Look, beignets. That, that, that was his prop. That's right. But I, it's okay. <laughs> is that, is that, I brought another one. It's the same thing. Oh, okay. so, okay. This is just powdered sugar. Okay, we got you want some more there. of that? Yeah, you got yeah. some over there. Go ahead and talk about your yeah, show, yeah. man. So, well, I want to talk about them real quick. So the beignet stand, they're a new spot that's located off Broadway and 410, mm -hmm. and they are serving up delicious beignets. They're from the Pearl Farmer's Market. And so... <laughs> You got Mike's got it all over. There you go. It's like oh, no shave November one. in here. You got the little powdered mustache. <laughs> yeah, it matches my hair at least. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it does. It looks good. But they're doing a great job. We have so many restaurants. We're going to Dallas, Austin. We're going all the way to San Antonio. Look, Kevin's even got some some napkins over there for us. Thanks, Kev. Oh, yeah. Awesome. And. We're making sure that we hit all the different cities across Texas to make sure we're representing all the different areas, the cultures, and the people, because there's so many different stories to tell about the food, including places like this right here. This is a Brazilian-style pizza joint that's from Dallas. They just opened up in Austin as well. It's a short drive to Austin to go have some really fun pizza. And get this, have you been to a Brazilian steakhouse where you flip the card? Like mm. red means stop serving me, green oh. means keep oh, yeah, going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. So that, it's a pizza place that's just like that. They keep bringing you pizza nice. and you really? flip green. Yeah, it's in Austin. It's so cool. This one right here, we're in Houston. We're going to the, one of the coolest New York delis in the state. And this place is serving up a giant sandwich. You won't believe it. I think we have a shot of it. I think we just showed it. But it is a, all that gets stacked into one sandwich right there. Look at this. Yeah, that yeah. was I mean, that was look, look at that. that was the sandwich in the teas that yes. David and I were that is like one sandwich. falling over for. How do you what, how do you eat that? I don't know, but one you, bite at a time. If you eat it, get this: they give you a free slice of cheesecake if you eat it all. The whole thing. <laughs> so right, you, you get more food if you eat it all, oh. which is just ridiculous. But it's so fun. Looks it's places good. like that, though. It's great stories. It's great people, and it's fantastic food. And that's what we're going to be sharing with everybody starting tomorrow on a brand new season at 10 o'clock in the morning. That is awesome. How much fun was it to go to like different cities? Because I know you've been to San Antonio for a couple of years while you've been doing this, but right, now right. you get to yeah. travel. It's, it's fantastic. Honestly, I couldn't have, have dreamed of a better opportunity to go out and experience different food. Um, both of the producers that are working with the show, you know, Ben and then my wife, she gets to stay home. So we have a kid at home, so she has to hold down the fort when I'm traveling all over the place. Oh, yeah. So shout out to, to my wife. She's doing a fantastic job as well. But it is so fun to travel around and just try all this different food. And what do you guys think about the beignets? I, if I was outside and it was humid, I think I was in New Orleans. <laughs> and, and he's got a lot of different flavors of these too, right? Yes, and that's the fun thing. So we're going to show you guys. They make burgers. They make chicken sandwiches. They do chocolate. They do sweet. They do savory. You don't have to just get the powdered sugar beignet. This is a traditional style, but they have so many different varieties. You have to watch tomorrow at 10 o'clock in the morning right here on KSAT 12 to find out more about this place, the beignet stand. The sandwich place was in Houston though, right? Sandwich that place is in Houston sandwich. and the pizza place is in Dallas. So we got you all, we're going all wow. over the state. We got you covered. And this is right there on Broadway inside 410, right? This is Broadway okay. inside 410, right next to Wild Barley, which is also a great spot that we're gonna be featuring on the show this season as well. Did you eat some of that sandwich? Oh, yeah. How did you take a bite? <laughs> Ask a silly Come question. On. It's called Texas did. Eats. You know? it, was it was Elder Eats, right? Because you know I was out there eating. You know I was doing uh, Let me just finish this, then you go ahead. Texas Eats and David Samples. That's yeah. right. Yes, yes, yes. But, but, never mind. <laughs> My question was, how did you eat the sandwich? Oh, how yeah. Long, so I we mean, took it out in sections. Like, take one bite out of that thing. Yeah, it was like a roast beef, a turkey. Like, they had different sections of the sandwich. So we ended up just taking it apart and just kind of eating smaller sections at a time. Yeah. And, you know, and you so, have to, <laughs> some to go. That's right. Sure. Oh, lots to go. That yeah. place, oh, my gosh. Our producer is telling us to wrap, but we're uh, eating. Right? I know. So you got to keep eating. You didn't win the cheesecake there. Yeah, you can. Yeah. But you yeah. didn't get it because you didn't eat it I all. did, actually. You have to watch. <gasps> what? I did. Well, okay, I didn't finish the sandwich, but I got to try the cheesecake. Oh, okay. Tomorrow at 10 o'clock in the morning. You guys can make sure you're tuning in. Brand new season of Texas Eats. We're gonna have a lot more food and more food for the anchors. We gotta feed you guys. Nobody feeds you. Yeah, well, we gotta we gotta <laughs> feed our, our producers also, <laughs> and our directors and Kevin. Yes. I see you back there. There you go. Mm, okay, I gotta we're take all, a bite. We're now. all waiting. Go ahead. Well, we'll pass them out. That is some <laughs> kind of beignet. Thank you for right being there. here. You guys, thank, thank you so you much for, for having me. All right, we it's always fun to, to be show. back. Thank yeah, you so much, y'all. Y'all can keep those.
Thank you. <laughs> As I walk away. <laughs> Thank we you. We see some coffee now, right? Yes, mm -hmm. for sure. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Deb. Thank you. Yeah. All right. We'll be right back. Clean up on aisle three.